Ian Shaw of Purdue, Colin Murphy of Indiana, Aiden King of Iowa, Ahmed of Michigan State with hip five, Kyle Griffith of Purdue, hip six, Alec Fleming of Purdue, hip seven, Ethan Meyer of Indiana, hip eight, Seth Eliason of Minnesota with hip nine, Jeremy Kloss of Michigan State, hip 10, Khalid Hussein of Minnesota, hip 11, John Piper of Purdue with hip 12, Luke Upton for the Boilers with hip 13, Connor Summer of Iowa with hip 14, and Jason Hoffman of Iowa, hip 15. Be nice. She's faster than everyone. And Hoffman of Iowa, your early leader. Yeah, that's what, uh, that's what Kit was saying. He's followed by Kyle Griffith of Purdue. I just wonder how accurate those are sometimes, uh, you know? It was like uh, in football, they always added weight to, you know, whatever your weight was. Women's cabinet improvements on the third attempt for Maddie Harris of Nebraska, 50 meters 17, 164 feet 7 inches. That's the best mark of the day. I think that Madison Luke that of Nebraska Carson? also improved on her third attempt, 38 meters 47, 126.2. 102 was the split at 400. In the lead, hip number 15, Jason Hoffman. Uh, Hoffman still in front. His teammate, Aiden King, running off his right shoulder. And then Griffith of Purdue on the inside rail in the third. Another one to watch for is Ahmed of Michigan State with hip five. This is Tyler, Mondo. We'll see the 800 split at the start line. At about 2.07. Aiden King of Iowa taking over the lead. Kyle Griffith of Purdue staying in pursuit. Ahmed also up there in the white over green of Michigan State. Now starting to make a move. Khalid Hussein of Minnesota, he's in the second. As we start the bell lap, we're some three minutes into the race. Hussein, now in front. And two Minnesota runners in pursuit. That's Eliasson. A man of Michigan State. Now you've got Griffith up there. Coming up for Minnesota Eliason. And it will be Eliason at the finish. At about 3.54, we'll see, yes, 3.54.29 for Eliason. <laughs> 